Hey Sub Nation, this is Essence Samashi from The Femme Spot. I'm back to you guys with another beauty tutorial. Now my last video I did, some of the viewers were asking questions about my makeup brushes and how they pertain to certain areas of my face. So here's Makeup Brushes 101. My foundation brush, I use this a lot for my concealer actually because it applies my product very easily and applies a lot of it. And you know, you could also use this for your liquid foundation. So I take my Laura Mercier and I apply it to my T-zone. The T-zone, it starts at the forehead, then it goes down to the chin, and then it goes across the face like a T, and which covers the underneath your eyes. So I take my concealer and I apply it beneath the dark circles. I apply it on my chin, my forehead, sometimes the bridge of my nose, and then I apply it on dark spots that I might have on my face. Then after I apply the product, I take my actual concealer brush and I blend it in if there's too much. So I go in circular motions underneath my eye, underneath my chin, and blend it in wherever I need to. This concealer brush is from e.l.f. I love e.l.f. products because they're professional makeup pro products, great makeup tools, and they're a great price. Then I take my angled brush and I use this for my cheekbones. So I do the fishy face and I take my Clinique makeup. I'm using Clinique bronzer right now and I rise up on my cheekbones. Now if you want to also apply this for a highlight, I squeeze it to make the shape of a fan brush. And this is actually what a fan brush looks like and the sizes vary. There's some huge fan brushes but there's some that's also this size. And what happens is when you squeeze it, it's the perfect shape to go on the bridge of your nose. And also if you want to do under your, underneath your eyes, but I don't use it for underneath my eyes. I use this with my gold deposit highlighter and I apply it on the bridge of my nose and on my cupid's bow. The cupid's bow is the, part, the upper part of your lip and right above your lip line. So this is a great highlight to make your color pop. So I'll apply it like this. Okay. Now I love this lipstick. Let me tell you guys because I brought this lipstick and I would never wear it, but I'm wearing it now today and I'm fell in love again. I brought this years ago. This is satin from Mac. Love it. Just in case you guys wanted to know. So my other essential brush I always use is my powder brush. Why? Because my powder brush is used to set my concealer or my foundation, whichever one I use for the day. So since I use the most concealer, I apply a lot of it underneath my eyes. I might just keep this in my bag to fix a dewy look which is a shine or you know if I'm sweating um, and I want to cover up some of the shine I'll use a powder brush. I'll keep an NC45 which is my makeup powder from MAC Cosmetics. So I'll apply it underneath my eye or anywhere around my face if I have a lot of foundation on. So guys this is part one of Makeup Brushes 1 in 1.